I use Google Drive on a daily basis. I upload all of my YouTube videos to it and it's how we deliver all of our weddings and commercial work. The only downside to the app that I can see is it's not very clear how you download videos onto your phone from Google Drive. So that's what I'm gonna show you in this video. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. My name's Chris. I'm a videographer, photographer, and YouTuber. I make all sorts of videos from product reviews to demos to how-tos to just me sat here telling you guys about my experiences. If you think you'd be interested in that, then please hit that subscribe button. So I watched some videos on this from a couple of years ago and the method seems to have changed since then. So I'm gonna make a really simple, quick video showing you how you can download your videos to your iPhone or your Android phone. So the first thing you need to do is open up Drive, obviously, and go to the file that you want to download. Now for all of my YouTube videos, I make a little teaser, which I then put on my Facebook page and my Twitter. So I'm gonna show you how I download those. It does work for any video, it doesn't matter how long it is, it just takes a longer time to download. So as you can see, I've got a couple of videos here ready to download. I've uploaded them on my computer and I wanna download them onto my phone so I can post them on social media whenever I want to. Um, so you would think if you press these three little dots that there would be a download link in this menu. So I think you used to go into open in and then it would prepare to export and download the video. And then when it's finished preparing, it would give you the option to save to your camera roll. Now it doesn't do that. And the closest thing you can do is save to files, which isn't what I want to do. So the way you do it now is you just press those three little dots, go into that menu and you do send a copy instead. And then if you scroll down, you've then got save video. And then this will download the video to your camera roll, which is exactly what I want to do. I don't want it in my files, I want it in my camera roll so I can then post it on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. So there we go, that's completed. Only took a couple of seconds. It will take longer if you've got slower internet. And then if you go into your photos, you can see that that video is there and ready to post. It's a really simple process, but it did take me a while to find that save video option. And I wish this video existed a month ago when I was trying to find out how to do it. If you like the video, please like the video. And if it helped you out, put a comment in the comment section below and subscribe so you never miss another episode. Thank you for watching and I will see you again tomorrow.